Hi everyone, today we will be doing an energy balance problem also using the steam tables. Your boss wants to increase the temperature of a pipe carrying saturated steam at a flow rate of 700 kilograms per hour at a pressure of 20 bar. He wants the temperature to be 300 degrees Celsius at the same pressure. His idea is to inject superheated steam into the line and the superheated steam is at a temperature of 350 degrees Celsius and a pressure of 20 bar. He wants to know what the ratio would be between the saturated steam flow and the flow of the injected steam. After reading the question, you should have drawn a process flow diagram that looks something like this. Once we've drawn the process flow diagram, we can begin to solve the problem by first writing out the energy balance. We can simplify our energy balance by assuming that heat transfer, shaft work, change in kinetic energy, and change in potential energy are all negligible or equal to zero. After making these assumptions, we can simplify our energy balance to the change in enthalpy equal to zero. We can expand our change in enthalpy term out, which further simplifies into the enthalpy of stream three equal to the enthalpy of stream one plus the enthalpy of stream two. From the saturated steam tables, we get the enthalpy of stream one, which is at a saturated steam at 20 bar to be 2,797.2 kilojoules per kilogram. The enthalpy of stream two, which is a superheated steam at 20 bar and 350 degrees C to be 3,139 kilojoules per kilogram. And then the enthalpy of stream three, which is also superheated at 20 bar and 300 degrees C is 3,025 kilojoules per a kilogram. We can plug the values we got from the steam tables into the simplified equation. In order to simplify the equation that we currently have, we need to reduce the number of unknown variables to just one. So in order to do that, we have to write a mass balance in order to solve for the mass flow rate of stream three in terms of the mass flow rate of stream one and stream two. This will allow us to plug our mass balance back into our energy balance and ultimately solve for the mass flow rate of stream two. Solving this equation explicitly for the mass flow rate of stream two, we find that the mass flow rate is 1,398.8 kilograms per hour. Now that we found the mass flow rate of stream two, we can finally find the ratio between the saturated steam flow and the flow of the injected steam, which we find to be about 0 0.500. If you like the video, leave a like and subscribe. Thank you.